Welcome to Smarts and Crafts, where we sit down with your favorite teachers and get to know them better. This week, we sit down with Mr. Littlefield to make some caramel apples. Um, I'm relatively new to the area. I, uh, I grew up in southern Beachy Wells, Maine, a real tourist trap of a town. And um, I've been in, I've lived in Greenfield for two and a half years now. I moved here because my partner and I had a baby and it's closer to both of our families. I moved down from Winooski, Vermont, where I finished my um, teaching program. Um, so I, I've been in the area for about two and a half years. So what do you do outside of school, for like hobbies and you know, for fun? Um, well, um, I don't know if I always call it fun, I call it life, uh, but I watch my child. Um, he's, he's only a year and a half, so he takes a lot of supervision, um, and it's uh, almost always super enjoyable, and that's awesome. If I'm not doing that, I like to go to um, a music show. Um, I am a huge fan of live music, which has been a little bit of a bummer since I've moved here. It's been very COVID and um, it's been a little bit hard to appreciate all of the new music venues and spaces available to me. So that's like my soul is uh, like is waiting for that to kind of open up again. What are you currently listening to? What am I currently listening to? All right, well, on the ride into work today, I had on Madonna's first album. Nice. Um, okay. Yep, I really, I really, really enjoy my 80s pop, my classic rock and my 90s alternative. Um, over the weekend, I had a nice um, pop session with some, with some old friends of mine. So we listened to hits of the 90s and the 2000s, which was really, really fun. A little bit silly, but really, really fun. Um, but if I like really am hard pressed of like, what's gonna make my soul sing, it's usually um, some raspy, um, high pitched um, classic rock singer. How has teaching at NHS been different from your previous job? Yeah, so um, my previous job being um, all, I had kind of like three in the mix at one time, but um, I was a house painter. Um, so it's much less physical um, here, which is a one of the most major drastic um, differences. Um, I have more intellectual stimulation and more social stimulation here, which is really healthy for me. Um, uh, I miss that physical element, but I really, really love engaging with uh, young adults in whatever content comes up. I, I could care less what it ends up being in terms of course content. Um, but so it's, it's less physical um, and it's more, it's more uh, interactive, it's more social. Who was your celebrity crush as a child? Oh my, oh my goodness. Um, oh, I know who it is. It was... Um, Joan Cusack in the, I think, original Adams Family movies. Um, the uh, she was like, I think her name was the Black Widow, and she would marry rich people and then murder them and get oh, their money. Her, her name's like Holly or something. Yeah, Holly something like Holly. that. But it was Joan Cusack for sure. Yep. Thank you so much for sitting down with us. We had a great time. Thank you so much for having me. Um, thank you for um, bringing these apples to my classroom and letting me keep a whole class of students outside the door for a couple minutes. That was really fun, thank you.